What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna go in over the Tatara Gaze, a brand new sniper that's come with Black Armory. We're gonna talk about how to get this sniper, perks to look for, because yes guys, it comes with random rolls. And we're gonna be talking about its overall stats. Now, for those of you wondering, Brave, I'm looking for a good sniper. Brave, I, I'm like with me guys, I am one who wants to use the Maxim all the time. The new Monarchy Sniper, the Maxim. Hard for me to break away from, and I can honestly say, just by using the Tatara Gaze, I'm in love with it, guys. I'm done using the Maxim. This is going to be my new sniper I'm going to be maining. Now, if you're wondering, the footage in the background, guys, is going to be mouse and keyboard. Yes, I used this sniper with a controller, and it feels great. I was going to upload footage of triples and quads and doubles, but again, guys, my footage got corrupt, and it sucks. I did want to upload that, so I just jumped into Crucible a few hours into it, doing some no-scopes and stuff like that. And this is the footage I acquired, and I said, that's not bad at all for just jumping in for a quick couple games. If you guys haven't noticed or you guys haven't jumped in yet, I have a Discord. Link is going to be in the description. You guys can join up, keep up to date with Brave Hero. You can post, you know, clips, uh, you know, anything like that, topics. It's all there, guys. As you can see on screen, I will leave the link to it in the description. It is a still, it's still a growing Discord, and we are growing slowly, which is awesome. But getting into the footage, guys, we're going to be getting into the weapon we're reviewing today, which is going to be the Tatara Gaze. Enjoy the video. All right, guys, this is going to be the Tatara Gaze. Now, you get this from, from Ado 1. You pick up a weapon frame from her. You go complete the quest, headshots, snipe shots, whatever it may be. It's super simple. Then you go out to the forge, complete the forge, and it's there. But in this video, we're going to be focusing on what perks to get, what, you know, mods to use with it. Now, Looking at the one I got here, guys, I'm not too concerned about barrels. Barrels are whatever, whatever preference you are, the you know, you care for. The next one we're looking for, guys, is what, you know, magazines type you're looking for. I went with the pendant magazine, which is going to give me four in a magazine, which is great when I pick up extra ammunition. Drop mag is one you want to stay for, stay away from, guys. Drop mag is terrible. Two rounds, you waste one, you reload. Literally, it subtracts rounds from you. So never go with drop mag on any sniper. Next one we have, guys, is going to be quick draw. One of my favorite perks to have on a sniper. Quick draw and snapshot are money. The last one, Genesis. Eh, it's whatever. Getting into what mods you should be using it for. I would recommend targeting adjuster for that little extra aim assist. And you can feel it when you use targeting adjuster. Or I would recommend Icarus Grip. I'm a warlock who likes to go in the air and snipe people. Icarus Grip, guys, feels awesome. Now, if I didn't have targeting adjuster in my pocket, I would pretty much put thrown Icarus Grip on this one. Now we're going over, you know, the base stats of it. You're looking at an impact of 90. It is your high impact sniper. Overall, you shoot somebody in the body. All you have to do is, look at that, Titan get juked. All you have to do is shoot somebody in the body. You can breathe on them, they're going to die. You can shoot somebody in the body and you can throw a freaking warlock melee from across, you know, the map and you're going to kill them. So not bad at all, guys, for a high impact sniper. Getting into the next, guys, we're, I always look for two stats on snipers. Aim assist. An aim assist of 45. Not bad at all. There are other snipers that have more. Alona as a god is probably the one with the most, but 45 isn't bad for what you're getting with a high impact sniper. The next one, guys, is going to be recoil direction. Now, probably wondering, Brave, why do I care about recoil direction on a sniper? Well, follow-up shots. You fire the sniper once, bringing the sniper down to do a second follow-up shot. Maybe the guy has a super. You shoot him once, he's not dead, follow-up shot. Recoil direction of 79, which is great. Getting into the curated ro roll you can get. Curated roll isn't bad at all. If you get the curated roll, I would recommend you guys keep it because it has snapshot. Now, box breathing, you don't get the benefit of it in PvP, but uh, snapshot is a great perk to have. Snapshot is something that is worth using, especially if you want to just turn around, turn on somebody real quick, aim down sights, and fire. Snapshot is a good perk to have. Getting into the perks you can get. Now, I'm going to put them all up on screen. We're going to go over the first column all the way to the right. So pretty much the last column. You can get Rampage. You can get Kill Clip. Dragonfly, Opening Shot, Genesis, or Box Breathing. Now, number one, what you do want to look for in a sniper is going to be Kill Clip. Why? Well, after you get a kill and reload, your damage goes up from 158 base damage to 210. Meaning, you can body shot any Guardian at any resilience with Kill Clip active. Let that sink in. Kill Clip. Now... If you're wondering, Brave, what about Rampage? Should I get Rampage on a sniper? Or Brave, I got Rampage on this. Is it gonna body shot Guardians? You can, when you have Rampage times three. Let that sink in, Rampage times three. Unless you were a beastly sniper, you will never proc Rampage times three. Oh, you might. All right, I'm gonna be, someone's gonna put in a comment section. Uh-uh, Brave, I did it. I did it once. 
No, Rampage times three, guys. Something you're never gonna proc, you know, especially with Sniper and the ammo constraints we have. Rampage times one, bo a body shot is 174. Rampage times two, you're doing a body shot of 190. And Rampage times three, a body shot of 205 damage. Again, you don't get the much, you don't get much benefit from it. So Rampage, eh, not, it's not a great perk to get. So Kill Clip's the number one perk. Opening shot, guys, isn't bad at all. For my, you know, my, my heroes out there, out there using controllers, Opening shot is a great perk to get, guys. The first shot, maybe you get a bigger hitbox. Overall, it's going to land more often. Next one I would say is Dragonfly. I'm a huge Dragonfly fan, especially if you get that new perk that extends Dragonfly, the explosion of it. Just imagine, get one kill, Dragonfly procs, boom, another kill. So on, under, under that column right there, Dragon Kill Clip, Opening Shot, Dragonfly, not bad at all. Rampage, all right. Maybe on, an, on a pulse rifle, a hand cannon. Sounds great. Next column over, guys, we're going to be looking at Outlaw, Rangefinder, Rapid Hit, Shield Disruption, and Quick Draw. Overall, guys, Quick Draw, Snapshot. If you get any of those, keep the weapon. That's why I'm saying Curated Roll, keep it. Those are really good right there. Quick Draw, Snapshot, pair that with Kill Clip, Dragonfly, Opening Shot, you're going to have yourself a good sniper. Overall, the magazines, Accurized Rounds isn't bad. You want to go with a little more range, Accurized Rounds is your friend. Maybe you want a pendant magazine like I didn't have four, four in uh, the chamber ready to go. That's something. Never go drop mag. I'll even make a one. If you guys want to know what, what drop mag does, I'll make a one minute video showing you on how much ammo you're going to be losing with drop mag. Other than that, guys, barrels. <sighs> barrels aren't too, you know, I'm not too impressed on barrels. Begin. It's your personal preference on what you want to use for barrels. But at the end of the day, if you can roll the perks I just mentioned, quick draw snapshot with kill clip, opening shot, dragonfly, you're gonna have yourself a monster sniper. And then the sights alone, if you can see in the footage in the background, like I said, the sights alone are nice. They're very nice sights. Open and clear, very, very nice. But again, if you're gonna be looking at a perk, yes, Rampage will do extra damage. I'm gonna hear it, I'm gonna see it in the comment section, I know. Rampage will have extra damage, but it's nothing that's gonna be, ooh, wow. You need Rampage times three, guys, to body shut. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And guys, if you haven't joined the Discord, join up. You can keep up with Brave Hero. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you in the next video.